Hello and welcome to this video on how to find save files for Minecraft on Windows 10 version and Minecraft Education Edition on a PC. The save location for Windows 10 and Minecraft Education Edition is different to your normal Java Minecraft folder and it's different to how you get to it. So I'm going to show you how you do that. Um, I will paste links to, to all of this in the video notes so you can copy and paste. Um, but I've got a folder here which is showing you the location of my particular um, file. So what we need to do is we need to get to the app data folder and the local folder and packages. So the easiest way to do that is to type this string directly into a finder window or a, a, an explorer window on PC and you will then be presented with all of the ranges of packages that link to all sorts of different bits of software. So be very careful when you're in here because deleting something could have a disastrous effect on your PC. So once I'm in packages um, I then need to scroll down to the Microsoft packages and you can see here there's lots of different Microsoft packages and we're looking for the Minecraft set of packages. You can see here there are two Microsoft.Minecraft packages. There's one there called Education Edition and one there called UWP. Uh, you can see why I haven't typed these in myself because they are a very uh, difficult string of characters to remember. So it's much easier just to go to your packages folder and then browse from there once you're inside. So for Windows 10, um, we're looking for the Microsoft.Minecraft UWP folder. If I open that, and then we are in here, uh, we then need to look for the local state folder, and we look for the games folder, and we look for com.moyang. Com.moyang is where we will find all of the world files for our version of Minecraft for Windows 10. So remember, Minecraft UWP is your Windows 10 version and it's local state, games, commo yang, and then Minecraft worlds. And you can see here I've got three worlds in my Windows 10 uh, Minecraft game. So when you do a file conversion from Java to Bedrock, you're going to need to paste your converted world save file into here in order to be able to access it in Windows 10 version. In terms of getting to the Minecraft Education Edition folder, it's exactly the same. We go back to Packages, and this time we go to Minecraft Education Edition, same local state, same games, same com moyang, and then Minecraft Worlds in there. And as you can see, I haven't got any saved files yet in my Minecraft Education Edition on this PC. To get to that address, remember, if you come into your um, Explorer window and you right click on the uh, drop down menu there and click Edit Address, it will show you the full address of your Minecraft Worlds folder. If you're making shortcuts to things, um, as I have on my desktop, then you could easily do that. For example, I often make a shortcut of my com moyang folder. If I drag that out whilst holding down the Alt key on my keyboard, you'll see there it's not going to move it to my desktop. It's going to create a link on my desktop. So if I create a link on my desktop, I click OK, and I'm going to rename that file com mo yang not shortcut you can rename shortcuts it's not going to make any difference com mo yang um, e e e folder for education edition and then when i double click on that at any time it'll take me straight into my minecraft education edition folder so i can quickly get access to resource packs skin packs minecraft worlds etc if i want to do the same for the other version of minecraft the windows 10 then i just simply scroll down and find that version here, open it up, open up my local state, open up my games, click on it and hold down the Alt key whilst I drag, put it on my desktop, click OK and again I'm going to rename that shortcut. Rename the shortcut, it does not rename the original folder remember, it only renames the shortcut, shortcut 
and I'm going to call that win 10 version. So I've now got two shortcuts to my Mojang files, Win10 and EE. So very quickly, when I need to put stuff into those game folders, having converted files to Bedrock, I can get uh, into those folders really quickly. And that's it. Thank you very much for watching. I will post links for those addresses directly into the uh, description so you can pick them up from there. Okay, thanks for watching.